Hey everyone, this is Michael Trudhart with your March 2022 Technology Tidbits update. Want to share this information while I'm out here watching March Madness on a beautiful Texas day. So let's talk a little bit about social media. RPR released a study that has gone back and looked at the usage of all, of, not all, but a lot of the major social media platforms that are out there. And it has shown that uh, the tactics and the platforms have definitely shifted for sure. So one thing that we want to look at is Facebook is still the most used platform, but usage is drastically down from 2017, 93% down to 78%. My opinion, based on the technology training that I've been doing, based on all the studies and the research that I'm seeing out there, I think that number is going to continue to drop. Uh, so you need to be mindful of that from a lead generation point of view for your business, that I don't think Facebook is going to be as dominant as what it has been in the past. And everybody says, well, why? Well, their, their numbers have gone down. Their actual users have gone down. They got rid of a bunch of ghost accounts at the end of last year. But I think there's also Facebook fatigue from a lot of people for various reasons. And it will be interesting to see what happens later this year as the Truth Social app starts to roll out even more and more. Uh, and there's a huge waiting list on that. And that's just for the iPhone users. So that will be interesting for sure. Instagram holding steady. LinkedIn, this was a big surprise to me. We saw a pretty big drop there in LinkedIn usage. YouTube's holding steady. Uh, Twitter, completely marginalized. I mean, they're toast, in my opinion. You, you just don't need to be using Twitter for your, for your business. And then TikTok, new kid on the block. Usage has jumped up. Uh, I will post something in the notes about TikTok. You just need to have full awareness on these platforms as to what they actually can do on your phones and on your system. So, you, you know, be mindful. I know everybody's like, well, TikTok's fun and I can use it for business. You also need to be mindful as to what they do with the data. As we all know, and, and you know this from my trainings, you probably know this from any of the research that you've done, video is a huge part on the social media platform. So I think you need to continue to look at using video, not just for YouTube. Another big up and comer is going to be Rumble. That is a Pepsi versus Coke type of situation when it comes to YouTube in terms of the channel that's out there. So if you've not looked at creating a Rumble channel, I think you need to. And I think that's going to be a great opportunity for you to build your business. But even though as this article is fo focused on social media, one of the biggest things that business owners fail to recognize is that they can still compete against Zillow, truly, if you're in the real estate world, and all the other big boys, depending on which, which platform that you're in, you can still compete and get to the first page of Google. And so you see right here, sell your San Diego home yourself has over 282 million search results. Our website that we've created for one of our clients is the very first one that's on there that is not an ad. And we have that replicated in many other markets for many of our clients. So don't forget, don't give up hope on the Google aspect. You can get to the first page. You can compete against the big boys. And I think you can do it better today than what you could five, six years ago, because there's more and more people with the mindset of, oh, I just got to go 100% social media. And, I, and just forget my, my web brand and forget my website. And that is not the case. So I strongly encourage everybody who watches this video, who reads my newsletter, come over to my website, fill in this form. It's a one-time fee for $99. It's an online success review. My design team is gonna go through your online brand, your social media brand, your web brand, take a look at everything, give you suggestions, whether you want to work with us and improve that, doesn't matter. You can take those suggestions, go and do them yourself, Go have your 12-year-old IT genius do them. We're here to help you to build your business. And we're going to go and dive deep with the online success review on your platforms. All right, guys. Thanks for listening. We'll see you next time.